the new Mutant Player is a plugin with instruments of different categories. Drums, bass, piano, synthesizer, vocal chops and many more. The Mutant Player itself and a lot of instruments are totally free, so that you can start right away. In this video we will show you how to set up and use the Mutant Player as well as some tricks how to get new free sounds. Happy to have you here and have a lot of fun! To install a Mutant Player you have to go to mutant.com spelled M-U-G-E-N-T dot com and if you scroll down a bit you will find the download link for Windows and Mac. There is also a link to this website in the description of this video. After downloading you should find the installer in your downloads. Unzip and start it with a double click. On Windows the Edge Web View 2 will be installed as well and you will see a corresponding window. This is necessary and has nothing to do with your browser. Please do not interrupt installation, otherwise the Mutant Player cannot work properly. After the installation has been successful, we are ready to get started. We open the Mutant Player in our DAW. In Cubase, Logic, Ableton, FL Studio or any other audio software you would like to use. So open up your door, create a new MIDI track and load the Mutant Player as a plugin. The Mutant Player is available as VST3 or also as Audio Units AU, also called Components. In case you haven't activated them already, you have to do so in the properties of your DAW. If VST3 or AU are active now, the Mutant Player should be available as plugin now, so that you can load it onto a new track and open the plugin. Now you have to create an account. For that you have to type in your email address and register. Then you will be sent an email to activate your account. Afterwards you are going to receive another email containing a link with which you can create your own password. When this is done you can log into your account directly within the Mutant Player. If you have FL Studio, you should definitely watch this video until the end because there's a very important additional setting for you. Now you can log into the plugin and you see the set menu with the three options. Go! This is what you click when you just want to get going, load exciting sounds and have fun. Refer a friend. Here you receive a link where you can recommend the Mutant Player to a friend. This link contains information on your account, which means as soon as your friend or whoever got this link from you begins to work with the Mutant Player, you will receive a credit worth 10 euros on your account. Then you can buy more instruments and kits. And you get 10 euros for every further person that uses the Mutant Player because of your link. This function is really cool, so I definitely recommend to use it. Third option, the Ultimate Bundle. When you start using the Mutant Player, you will notice that some of the instruments and kits are free and some do cost money. With the Ultimate Bundle, you will get all instruments and kits that are going to be released within one year for 99 euros. And this is no subscription, because you will own these instruments and kits forever. This means if you used one of the sounds in your project, it will still work in 5 years. In case the menu is not visible anymore, but you want a link to refer a friend, or by the ultimate bundle, you can still find the links here in the upper right corner. Attention FL Studio users! With some plugins, FL Studio has a problem with the buffer size, which could lead to unwanted noise. To avoid that, I would recommend clicking on this gear wheel within the Mutant Player. Then go to the second symbol where you can also see the small gear wheel and then click Troubleshooting. Here you can select the function Use Fixed Size Buffers, 
With this function activated, you shouldn't have any problems running the Mutant Player. Now, a short introduction to the Mutant Player. If I click on Instruments here, you can load all instruments and directly play them using your keyboard. Every instrument also comes with a MIDI file, which you can drag onto your arrangement. If you here click on FX, you have an exciting selection of effects available for your instruments. Here you can find the kits, which are complete arrangements. So if you load a kit, every instrument of this kit will be loaded automatically. You can also drag and drop the MIDI files that have been used in this arrangement. So you can assign the different MIDI channels to the according instruments. Thank you for watching our video. We wish you a lot of fun with the instruments and kits in the Mutant Player. If you haven't done it already, then please subscribe to this channel. It's free and you will be notified whenever a new video about music production has been uploaded to this channel. Until then, always stay creative. Cheers!